Helicobacter pylori, or H. pylori, is one of the few bacteria that can survive the acid environment of the stomach. In 2005, researchers Robin Warren and Barry Marshall were awarded the Nobel Prize in Medicine for confirmation that H. pylori is the major cause of stomach ulcers, as opposed to stress or spicy foods, as previously thought. H. pylori infection can cause stomach and intestinal ulcers, nausea, vomiting, and abdominal pain. Ulcers in the stomach and intestines are uncommon in children, but when they do occur, they cause a lot of belly pain, blood in the stools, or bloody vomiting. H. pylori is found in the stomachs of many healthy adults. It lives within the mucous lining of the stomach and can be transmitted through saliva by kissing or sharing utensils. The most reliable way to confirm H. pylori infection is to perform upper gastrointestinal endoscopy. A small flexible tube camera is inserted into the stomach through the mouth. Biopsy samples of the stomach wall can be viewed under a microscope for evidence of this bacteria. This test also can, can determine to what degree the stomach and intestines are inflamed and whether or not an ulcer is present. A stool test for H. pylori infection is available. The test is good for determining the presence of the bacteria, uh, but can't determine to what degree the stomach and intestines are inflamed or damaged. A blood test is available for H. pylori infection, however it cannot tell the difference between a current or past infection. Children are often treated with triple therapy. This includes two antibiotics for two weeks and an acid blocker medicine for two to three months. The stool test can be used to, to determine if the bacteria have been eliminated. This is Dr. Michael Davis. For more information on this and other kids' health topics, please visit our website, HealthyKidTips.com.